pipelining what do you mean by pipelining in earlier processors microprocessors what what used to happen is when one instruction uh, you know before the next instruction is fetched the first instruction needs to fetched the first instruction needs to fetch decode and execute then only the next instruction is fetched then only the next instruction can be fetched okay so in my in earlier microprocessor what what used to happen is before the next instruction is fetched we need to perform the first instruction we need to execute the first instruction completely that means these three need to these three operations need to perform the uh, the first instruction need to be fetched decode and executed then only the the next instruction can be fetched so it is very long process in which um, the next instruction need to wait for a long time so uh, in modern microprocessors what uh, it uses a technique called uh, pipelining technique in which when first instruction when first instruction is fetched and fetching is completed then it goes for decoding so this second instruction starts fetching while the first instruction is decoded and when it executes the second instruction is decoded and when the second instruction is decoded the third instruction is uh, started fetching so you can see right so this is how when the first instruction um, so when the first instruction starts decoding the second instruction is fetched so this is called as pipelining technique so these um, um, multiple instructions are parallelly executed so then we call it as pipelining so here by doing this we can improve the performance of a um, microprocessor and so that the uh, speed will be increases the instructions are more efficiently performed